Shall we rise to our faith tonight? There is no God like Jehovah. Jubilee. You can. Any year can become a year of Jubilee. Praise God. Anytime you receive God's visitation. Is your year of Jubilee. Hallelujah. And tonight. God will visit you. The time of Jubilee. Is the time of release. Jubilee is a time of release. Your debt is cancelled in the year of Jubilee. Time of Jubilee is a time that slavery comes to an end. Time of Jubilee is a time of liberation. And of course, time of Jubilee is a time of the Holy Spirit. Tonight, without wasting time, we want to bring God's servant to minister to us. We've been enjoying his ministry since Friday. It was awesome Friday night. It was great this morning. And of course, is here despite all the challenges and with the great sacrifice coming all the way from Eastern Texas to be a blessing uh, to us in this year convocation. Join me as I bring up God's servant, Apostle Matthew Oluwajaba. Let somebody praise the name of the Lord. Let somebody praise the name of the Lord.
shall be do also. And greater works than this, greater works than this shall he do, because I go on to my Father. And I want us to just give a look onto the book of Matthew, chapter 12. I want to read verse 27 and 28. In verse 27, the Bible says, And if I, my best servant, cast out devils, my own two young children cast them out, therefore they shall be your judges. But if I cast out devils by the Spirit of God, then the kingdom of God is come unto you. Shall we pray? Everlasting Father, you are the Lord, you are mighty and wonderful, you are glorious and you are powerful, you are the one that reigns in majesty, we worship you, we we'll give you all the glory. Tonight, manifest your power in this place, in the name of Jesus Christ, manifest your power in this place, in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, when this was written, I just said this is a good sign, it's a good sign for this convention. And we can feel it. There is the showers of blessing. Not just, not just rain that is pouring out, pouring down, but it is the showers of blessing. And we just pray that you are going to release your blessing upon your people in the name of Jesus Christ. You are going to release your blessing upon your people in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Father. For Jesus, mighty name, we have prayed. Jesus mighty name of prayer. Um, let me just say this to you. What God has spoken can never be reversed. When God said this is what I want to do for you, that is exactly what he will do. In this convention, God wants you to excel. God wants to bless you. God wants to make you great. And the Holy Spirit wants you to be saved. The Holy Spirit wants you to be transformed. The Holy Spirit wants your life to receive a great turnaround. And there shall be a turnaround in the name of Jesus Christ. In this convention, God wants our ministries, yes, Redemption Family Church, God wants this ministry to excel. God wants this ministry to fulfill the purpose. God wants this project not to remain in the picture. God wants it to come into reality. It's a dream that is going to come into reality in the name of Jesus Christ. So all this is only good to happen. And it is going to happen in the name of Jesus. So our Lord Jesus Christ said, if you believe in me, this works that I do, you also will do the same. And greater works than this we shall do. That's why this convention is themed that greater works than this. Greater works than this. So I believe if God wants us to do greater works, He also wants us to be blessed beyond our imaginations, beyond our thoughts, beyond our plan. God wants something new to happen in our lives. And it shall be so in the name of Jesus Christ. How? Oh, one of the secrets that we have discovered that are made by our Lord Jesus Christ to be able to do all the works that no one will be able to do and no one can do. One of the secrets that we discover is the Holy Spirit power. He started with the Holy Spirit. And the Holy Spirit has been with him. And until now, the Holy Spirit has been with him. So if it is the Spirit of God that has made this thing happen, that has, that has made it happen in this time, the same Spirit will make it happen in our whole time. In the name of Jesus Christ. If the Holy Spirit may have our Lord Jesus Christ to succeed and make it to accomplish that purpose, the same Spirit will make our life to accomplish our purpose in the name of Jesus Christ. Now, Jesus' authority was questioned. Jesus' authority was questioned. And he said, Oh, who is casting out demons? He is casting out demons by the diversity of the head of demons. The head, the beginning of demons. 
Yeah. 
foundation. Foundation of errors. Foundation that was wrongly laid. Foundation of demons. Foundation of Ogro. Oh yeah. Oh my God. They want this kind of thing that they will name us after God's names. It's time to shake that foundation. That foundation has been holding you down. That foundation has been tying you down. That foundation has not allowed you to move forward. On that day, the foundation of imprisonment was shaken. Was shaken. And the Bible says, immediately, every mouse, every person's chain broke. Ah, there's some chain. There's some chain that must be broken tonight. There's some chain that must be destroyed tonight. There's some chain that must be uprooted tonight. There must be. There's some chain that must be overthrown tonight. Receive. Receive power. power to uproot it, power to destroy it, power to break it in pieces. Receive it in the name of Jesus. Receive it in the name of Jesus. Two people were praying, two people were singing hymns, two people were praising God, making it to understand. Praise can lose. People from bondage, praise can break every chain, every shackle. Praise can remove mountains. Praise can overthrow demons. Praise can turn things around. Somebody praise the Lord. Or just to be doing something different. He what? He has touched your mouth. He has touched your tongue. To pray and pray sin. Somebody said, Amen. Amen. Somebody said to somebody, And we are ready to praise the Lord. I am ready to praise the Lord. Say to your neighbor, I am ready to praise the Lord. You are ready to praise it. In this, in this season. Shot against your prosperity, the door that has been shot against your advancement, the door that has been shot against your journey to the land of Canaan because you are going to the promised land. All those doors are in command to the power of the Lord. Lose, be on board in the name of Jesus. Be on board. Jesus, you don't understand the middle of all of those. When the earthquake happened, the first thing was foundation. Every foundation that cannot carry the glory of God tonight be uprooted in the name of Jesus. Be uprooted. 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 In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Be uprooted. Power. Power. Receive power. Receive power. Receive power, receive power, receive power, receive power, receive power, power, in the name of Jesus. Say, I uproot every foundation that is delayed my glory. I uproot every foundation that is delayed. Uprooted. Say, 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 say. Be uprooted. Be uprooted. Be uprooted. Be uprooted. In the name of Jesus. Be uprooted. In the mighty name of Jesus. The Father, the Father's have eaten the summer grapes, but the children teeth are set on edge. Uproot that foundation. Uproot the foundation. Uproot the foundation. In the name of 
of Jesus. Uproot that foundation. Uproot that foundation. In Jesus' name, we have prayed.
out the single entry you just need to spend a few days when you go out back to your country you can never come back again god told me that you are going to stay there i didn't know the reason the the brother the, 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 the immigration officer just said that he said you don't need to go to lagos anymore i'm giving you the resident permit i didn't know the meaning so i went to my house the host said hey he took my passport he went to his lawyer and his lawyer said excuse me that, that lawyer said he's a woman he said who is that man who is that man he said do you know what he has got what when, what many people will suffer and suffer and suffer for what can make some people, and i was single by that time what can make some people to marry the person they are not supposed to marry because they are in need of the resident permit from resident permit to permit to permanent permit and from permanent residence yes to citizenship and today i'm thanking god that it's not only citizen of britain citizen of america also in both side reason foundation 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 majority of you prayed and prayed and prayed and you don't know what has gone wrong it might be the foundation i say it might be the foundation when the earthquake happened in the prison yard god did not take god did not first take paul and salas out he did not first break their their chain he first shook the foundation foundation means that you second the foundation means that you are not a prisoner you are not among the prisoners sir. you are a free man every foundation that is delaying you every foundation that does not allow you to progress every foundation that is tying you down pray tonight pray 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 in the name of jesus pray in the name of jesus Break! 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 In the name of Jesus! Robi, I can say the higher Foundation! Foundation! All this thing has come tonight! Ah! Some people, they don't leave the prayer mountain. Some priests, Pray, 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 pray. And you will see there is nothing to show for it. There is nothing to show for it. And some people, they will just take the first step, and every other step will just follow. Apart from you carrying the grace, foundation is so important. <laughs> Psalm 11, verse 3. If the foundations are destroyed, what can the righteous do what can the righteous do the righteous are just praying nothing happens the righteous are just struggling using every method every system but system does not work because something is waging war against them something is holding them down something is working against their lives Look at the foundation of Rubenite. Because Rubenites were cursed in the Bible. Tell me any tangible thing that the Rubenites performed or did in their lives. Ah, I did not know that Oluwa Joba, that Oluwa Yosef, Oluwa Fed Joba. I said, me, Oluwa Fed Joba, there. Moti man choruko ye. Baba mi at mama mi, oruko tev mama ye. Baba Joba, mama Joba, Baba Joba. I did not know that there was something behind that name. The moment the foundation of Ifa was turned upside down, was broken. Ah, and Oluwa Siberesi Joba. Every place I put my feet upon, Oluwa Waberesi Joba. If I go this place, Oluwa Joba. If I go this place, God reigns. I have never met anything difficult in my life. Once the foundation has been broken, every evil foundation every foundation that cannot carry the glory of god every terrible foundation every foundation of heroes i command the fire of god be conserved be conserved by fire by 
fire in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Let me hear him. God is doing something among you here in choir. God is doing something. I can feel it from here. Chains are broken. I can feel it. Shackles are falling off. I can feel God. I can feel the power of God moving in this place. Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. Break through in the name of Jesus. Receive your breath. 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 In the name of Jesus. Something must change. Something must change. Power must change hands for you. In the name of Jesus. Power such power. Power of God. We change hands for you in the name of Jesus Christ. After this minute, you will not be begging anybody to come and sing anymore. I can hear, I can see it. Are you coming for practice today? Hey, I cannot come today. You know, I have some assignment. Ah, people will be the one begging, rushing to this side. In the name of Jesus Christ, this place will not be able to take you anymore. This place will not be able to contain you anymore. In the name of Jesus Christ, receive the power. Receive the power. Receive the power. Power to increase. 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 In the name of Jesus. You are going to increase. And you are going to, to excel. I pray for you by the authority of God that tomorrow, the last final day, when you are ministering, the host of heaven will join their voice together with you. And there shall be showers of blessing. The glory of the Lord will come down in the name of Jesus Christ. Receive it! Power! Receive power! Receive power! Receive power! Receive Holy Ghost! In the name of Jesus! The one that is preparing for the exam, you are going to pass that exam. Mark my word. You are going to pass that exam. Go say that it's, as, it's coming to to a level to a stage that among you we have medical doctors, registered nurses, we will be having lawyers. What I perceive in my spirit as one among you will be reading law. I just can feel a someone among you that will be a qualified medical doctor. Why am I saying this? Because what Lord has revealed to me. God will pass through you. Amen. As Jesus was passing by, he will pass through you. Amen. And he will make you what he created you to be. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Let somebody say amen. amen. The foundation was broken. Because they were praying. Praises. Every foundation. Your foundation has changed. Amen. I said your foundation has changed. Amen. It has turned to First Corinthians eleven, first oh, First Corinthians three eleven, that no other foundation can anyone lay that down than that which was laid, which was Jesus Christ. When the foundation is upon Jesus, the foundation of pure or soul, we understand the foundation of Judaism. But when the Lord turned him to the foundation of Christ, you see what happened. As you are standing, it's like I want you to remain standing. The last thing God wants you to do with your mouth is to prophesy. God wants you to prophesy. Ah, Peter said, This is the prophecy that has come to pass from the prophet Joel that it shall come to pass, and that I will pour out my spirit upon all flesh. You are going to prophesy. Your mouth is to prophesy. Let me tell you, God is the one that is going to do it. But you are the one that he wants to use. Like Jeremiah 51 verse 20. When he said you are my battle axe. And the weapon of war. So you are God's battle axe. I want you are going to prophesy tonight. Prophesy for what? 
prophesy into your life. You will prophesy the good thing that you want the Lord to do for you. In five minutes that I'm going to leave this place, you are going to prophesy. Our mouth is to prophesy. To prophesy. When it changes your speech, when it empowers you, it touches your mouth to, to speak in tongues, to pray to him, to praise him, and to prophesy. And as you can say, it's get 37 from verse 1 to 14. The hand of the Lord is upon me. The hand of the Lord was upon me. And he made me to pass through an open valley. And inside there, there were many bones in open places. Behold, they, are, they were very dry. And the Lord said to me, Son of man, can these bones live? And I say, Oh Lord, you know. I've never seen anything like this, but you know. And the word of our Lord came to me. And God said, Son of man, prophesy to these bones. Prophesy to these bones that they may live. And the Lord said, Prophesy. And the man of God opened his mouth and he said in verse 7 uh, so as I prophesied oh my God so as I prophesied I prophesied as I was commanded as I was commanded and as I prophesied there was a noise oh my God when something great is about to happen a noise will first happen there's some of you here people are making so much noise about you noise a noise is different from a voice God never makes a noise God makes a voice a child of God does not make a noise a child of God makes a voice so it was not a voice but a noise suddenly there was a noise where your blessing is about to happen there's going to be a noise when God is about to move you to the next level there's going to be a noise he said there was a noise and behold there was a rattling what is it shaking God want to shake anything that is disturbing you God want to shake anything that is working against you and as I promise the bones came together bone to bone the bone the left bone might be the macula and the right bone was in sango they, they look for each other they look for their match bone to bone is your life a dry bone is your ministry a dry bone is your marriage a dry bone is your career a dry bone is your business a dry bone what is a dry bone in your life what is a dry bone in your life every dry bone every good thing that the devil has done to become a dry bone i command receive life in the name of jesus Receive life, receive life, receive life, receive life, receive life, receive life, receive life in Jesus' name. Receive life, receive life, 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 receive life, receive life, receive life, receive life in the name of Jesus. The first promise I want to prophesy to your situation save my situation receive the word of God this time receive the word of God my situation you are changing for better right now say I prophesy I prophesy that tomorrow about this time tomorrow about this time there shall be Testimony, there shall be breakthrough, there shall be total victory in the name of Jesus. Prophesy, 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 prophesy to your situation. My situation, receive the word of God. My situation, my condition, 
receive receive the word receive the word of God you need to change change for better change for better you have to change my situation has to change my situation received a change prophesy 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 thank you father in jesus mighty day we pray if you are believing god for healing please quickly rush in you are believing god for healing Maybe you are going to certain health challenges. You don't need to mention it. But you trust God that God is going to heal you. Come forward here. If you are trusting God for healing, I want you to come forward here. And I want you to speak it quick, quietly. Without anyone hearing you, what you want the Lord to do for you. You are trusting God for healing. You want the Lord to heal you. You are trusting God for healing. And this is the day. I want to prophesy to the dry bones. Yes. He have the word of the Lord. Come alive. I saw somebody with kidney problem. And I say, come alive. That kidney must come alive. Come alive. In the name of Jesus. Father, in the name of Jesus. Father, in the name of Jesus. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus. You are bruised for our iniquities. You were wounded for our transgressions and the chastisement for our peace was upon you and by your stripes we are healed so therefore i speak authoritatively i speak by the power of god every sickness every disease that is present here i command you in the name of jesus christ of nazareth disappear Disappear, 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 disappear in Jesus' name. Disappear, 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 disappear in the name of Jesus. The woman that cannot sleep without using medication, it is over tonight. You shall begin to sleep without struggling in the name of Jesus Christ. Testimony will follow because tonight you will sleep like a baby in the name of Jesus. Someone that the devil has planted five broad, five broad in your womb. I command that fibro to be melted down in the name of Jesus Christ. Be melted in the name of Jesus Christ. Anything of headache anything of fever anything of malaria anything of pain back pain chest pain pain in the waist pain in the neck i command you to disappear tonight in the name of jesus christ disappear disappear in jesus name disappear in jesus name disappear in jesus name disappear disappear in the name of jesus the word of God says, the foreigners fade away and come frightened from their dear, when they are hide out. We are never any sickness by be hiding itself in your body. I command it out in the name of Jesus Christ. Come out, 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 when you, when you were so smart before but now when you read you forget and I saw two people, the Lord said to me that there is a spirit of loss of memory that even let's say you are in the kitchen you want to go into the room to pick up something or you are in your room you want to pick up a cup in your kitchen when you get to the kitchen you forgot what the reason why you were there you've been forgetting things you put key here You'll be looking for it in another place today every every demon of loss of memory disappear from their lives in the name of jesus christ disappear in the name of jesus disappear in the name of jesus regain your memory regain your memory 
regain your memory in the name of Jesus. People that have been turned down in their, in their processing their visa by the authority of God, because there's someone, is a man, it's so important to say this that by the authority of God, before this year runs to an end, you will get your visa in the name of Jesus Christ. Your visa will be in your hand in the name of Jesus. God says, you pray for anyone that is looking unto the Lord for the fruit of the womb. And not only those that are looking unto the that, that, that are here, even if you are representing anyone that is looking unto the Lord for the fruit of the womb, if you know anybody like that, say the name quietly. Say the name out quietly. Rima Sunni Kapuli Marabia. Because that person will give you testimony. Because you will tell her that I pray for you in our church. And this year, the person will conceive by the authority of God. And you will tell pastor, you will come to reverend that it has happened. By the authority of God, everyone looking at the Lord for the fruit of the womb. Those who are here, those who have been here by their representative. I say, carry your babies in the name of Jesus Christ. Take your babies, take your babies, carry 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 your babies. Carry your babies in the name of Jesus. Those who are praying to have their own husband or to have their own wives, that Lord God Almighty, I call unto you because the Bible says, it says, search the word of the Lord and read. Say, not one shall, uh, shall, shall fail. He said, no, 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 no one will lack a mate. I tap into that word. That he who created them in the beginning created them male and female. Let your husband or your wife, uh -uh, let them come now in the name of Jesus Christ. Even if it's not you, but it's your daughter. Our husband will locate her now in the name of Jesus Christ. Our husband will locate her now in the name of Jesus Christ. By the power of the Lord, everyone pray for their life partner. Today, God has answered your prayers in the name of Jesus Christ. Finally, for this ministration, stretch out your hand. And everyone that is a business people or career people, you can join them in this blessing. Rima shaking that road in the hill. Now, tell God what you want the Lord to do for your business or for your Maraka Biba Senior. For your business or for your career or on your finances. I saw three people. One in the ministerial place there they are looking for a particular contract that spent so much on me on it but the Lord is saying to you that it will make it easy now that you are going to get that contract done yes what are the things that you want the Lord to do for you in your career in your business Rabbi God told me that you are a servant of God. You can do more than what is happening right now. I saw you going from one place to another. And you are a servant of the Lord. Not only that, you're going to be a businessman. You're going to be traveling and you're bringing things. It's not that you're going to sit down over there. You're going to be going and you're coming. Because you are one of the pillars that will sponsor ministries. Because it's in your mind. And that's why God said, I'm going to make it happen. God said, it's going to make it happen. Because anytime when you pray, so give me money that I'm going to use to worship you. That I'm going to use to serve you. That's what your prayer has been doing. And the Lord said, today, it's going to make it happen. In my language, he said, only Aki you, only Aki When we talk about the things of God, you are everywhere. You fall, you, you, you service here, you service there, you service here, you're there, and you're there. But only one thing you are saying, God, give me money. You have been using your strength for God. But only one thing you need is money because you have wisdom. And that money will come by the authority of my decree. What will make you to serve him with all your heart. But the Lord said, don't forget this house. Don't forget this house. This house will produce you. Don't forget this house. Because it's going to happen. It's going to come to pass. Because delay, that is what the enemies are using against you. And I cut it off today in the name of Jesus Christ. Cut off that spirit of delay. Receive the power of the Lord. Let the plan of the Lord be fulfilled in your life in the name of Jesus Christ. Sir. I want you to have more time for your prayers and fasting because of where the Lord is taking you to. I want you to pray more. I want you to fast more. And the Lord wants to put yourself in. After this conversation, go to seven days fasting and prayer. And the Lord said He will answer you of what you are saying because it's not something we can decline in the public. The Lord said He will answer you. Seven days. Seven days. 
break in the evening break in the evening just pray for your purpose to be fulfilled purpose fulfillment is about location it's not it's not about location and when it changes your location you see what is going to happen it's about the location god is going to work it out and the god said you must endure because you must not give up don't give up in the name of jesus everybody say to the lord that it is well yes it is well with you yes yes is there any other thing that you want the lord to do is going to do it intimidation is over in your life that's what the lord said to me intimidation is over in your life you have been in a place where they intimidated us but you stood by god and the lord's name was glorified so therefore intimidation is over so this is the time to harvest begin to harvest begin to harvest in the name of jesus christ proclaim this to every member of your family that jesus is coming back soon in the name of jesus you have seen miracle raw like this so god wants to use your hand to perform miracles receive it in the name of jesus christ everlasting father bless your people bless your people things will change for better i promise i to every person's life that what you have decreed now it shall be established it shall come to pass 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 in the name of jesus christ my last word yesterday if you were here yesterday night my last word is that there shall be showers of blessing that's what was my last word and i'm saying it again that in your life as he has come in the physical now as you are going to see the miracle of god there shall be showers of blessing receive 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 in the name of jesus daddy muria will go on the sea really what if all the other see ya over the same foundation or in the now and also to me that it will make it easy but whatever plan you have now whatever planning thing that you run maybe architectural design you will change it very soon reason is because it's not complete what is there you know i saw a very big land and i saw it how god made it happen and i saw that oh you will see and that thing you talk to talk to mama say oh and that's the lady group the lady kelly you might have a place then there's another vision that's coming you might have put the lady i want to come bye bye the lady now she back let the word of my of, of my mouth which the lord is declared is declared to come to pass over this ministry in the name of jesus christ all right but i want to tell you this is the one that i met what i asked but all of this set up with tv station to my christian christian station so they were my pure and pure and it's you that i saw you having it i saw it i can see it it's you the lord is releasing into your hand and there is no power of darkness that can change this in the name of jesus christ and as a school that is making disciples saw it like disciples he's making disciples and i saw those disciples that they were all over all over the nations and oh my god dividing the word of god and i could see you say ah i'm thanking god this vision is fulfilled nothing is going to contest contest with your vision again in the name of jesus christ god says there shall be showers of blessing there shall be showers of blessing as if we come from every side and things will get better in the name of jesus christ uh, there's an hereditary blessing the lord has given unto you why some people are carrying curses you are carrying blessing you are carrying blessing that is this that is the there's a priesthood priesthood kingdom that is passing from one generation to another and you might be the third generation you might be the second generation but i saw that till christ comes <laughs> the scepter the scepter the scepter shall never the scepter of the kingdom we're talking about the scepter shall never depart from judah 
to God so that the priesthood kingdom can, can never depart from your family. Because each person will just be passing it from one another to another to another. Because there is a blessing of God that has been established there. Now, the Lord now said to me that every year, every year, there must be a celebration of praise. And you are the one to organize it. Celebration of praise. What is going to be praise concert? And let people come and praise God. And come and see what is going to happen. Because majority of the spiritual daughters, they also will begin to serve God. And doors will be opening for them. And miracle will begin to happen. And wonders of the Lord will begin to take place. And there shall be increase. In the name of Jesus Christ. God said he has blessed all your seeds. And they are blessed. And someone, one among them told you, Mommy, pray for me on this particular thing. And you said to her, that it's going to be done. And the Lord said, it's already done. And you see, after this convention, few days after, he will tell you, Mommy, they have given it to me. I have got it. And it is settled. In the name of Jesus Christ. So I pray for promotion, elevation. I pray for success. And I pray that everyone, when you come in the morning tomorrow, you will have testimony. In the name of Jesus Christ. That will not permit me, but I say, everyone, receive the blessing of God. Receive the blessing of God. Receive God's blessing. In the name of Jesus. There shall be showers of blessing. In the name of Jesus Christ. God said, I should say a word to the African community. Where is it? I pray for you in the name of Jesus Christ. I pray that the hands of the Lord that is upon you, yes, will never be removed in the name of Jesus Christ. I pray that there's something that you are believing God for, trusting God for in this convention, even in the afternoon, it's God said you pray about it. And it has come to pass. Because you have prayed over it again, and God will make it happen in the name of Jesus Christ. There shall be a performance. Thank you, Father. I give you praise and I bless your holy name. In Jesus' name we have prayed. Amen. Praise the Lord.